that we've made as a community in providing hope and opportunity for our kids and safety for the ones we love when that goes away like it did today. So it hurts. Uh, there are a lot of worried parents who we've had folks out here reassuring. Obviously we're getting the kids home uh, as fast as we can. Um, our police bureau is in pursuit of the suspects and, um, and our, our medical personnel at at our great local hospital is taking good care of the kids that got hurt. So there's there's uh, things to be hopeful for, but there's also a lot of sadness here. You said suspects, are they pretty? I don't know if there's one or more than one, but they are in pursuit. Um, what did you say to the families? Yeah. Uh, I'm just here to provide support for the families and for the great people at Rosemary Anderson High School because it does wonderful work. Uh, and to, to give what comfort that I can to the families and to the folks that are waiting to bring their kids out. You know, the parents have been pretty calm, probably calmer than I would be under the circumstances. I think part of the um, reality of the times we live in is almost every kid's got a cell phone, so most of the parents that were coming here to pick up their kids knew their kids were already okay. And I think that helped everybody.